Hey, Swami Gang Gang, we're playing Telltale's The Walking Dead, Season 1, Episode 2, Part 4. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. You killed her. You're back! What happened? <laughs> handled it, Mama. Oh, we handled it all right. He flat out murdered a woman. But I have a feeling you don't care. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Mm. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, oh, why don't you? Oh my god. Well, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What is it now? This sounds mm. new. God. What's going on with them? Seriously. Dunno. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Oh wow. Way to state the obvious, ma'am. I'm so glad you picked up on that. Yeah, you could say that. They don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. Oh, I wish it was. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. You mean she actually fixed the cow? She she's a small animal veterinarian. How how does she how does she do that? Hi, Sweepy. Why'd you close the door? I'm gonna go over there. How else am I gonna give you your hat back? I told you I'd give it back. Hello. Hello, murderer. Glad I got to use her today. What, your gun? My girl here. <sighs> Y'all need a minute? Like, I'll, I'll come back. You really like that gun. Too much. What's not to like? Ew. I was kidding, sir. You know, it's just a gun. It's just a gun. Yeah. That's where you're wrong. What? This is Charlotte. She's <laughs> as faithful as a starving hound when you got a bone in your pocket. The fuck? But you notice my suspicion? Yeah, it's a little suspicious. You're out here stroking your gun in front of the children, and I'm the weird one? How do you run this place with just one cow? Yeah. You used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. We got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. And how are we paying for that deal? You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. It sounds like it's about to storm. Y'all wanna head in the house? Maybe get an early, uh, early start on dinner there? Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Um, no. We just found a woman, and Danny shot her. We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow, so Danny killed her. Holy shit. Was she one of those bandits? Nope. I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something. But then, he just went off. I don't like this, Lee. I still say we should go back to the Motor Inn, where we at least know what to expect. If you can gather everybody together, I'll just tell the St. John's that we can't make it to dinner tonight. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. He's not wrong. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? <sighs> we are guests here. We don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Both of y'all are correct. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Well, it seems like he likes you. Can you tell him to just back off a little bit, please? How do you put up with him? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. 
So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. I get that, and I'm trying to be the bigger person here. But your dad also just needs to be nice. Have him just shut up, that's all I'm asking. Did you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? I told <sighs> you. That's nothing. What? Lee! Don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. No, it's I not! I you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. We should skip it entirely. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. That's somewhat better. Um, I'll take what I can get at this point. I mean, at least he's not yelling at me. Hey, guys. Is a cow feeling better? Looks good. Oh, Sid. This cow's like, please save me. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Just says Mabel could have her baby tonight. She's pregnant? We'll see, Clementine. I thought the cow was sick. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> hey there, Andy. Yeah? Where's Woody and Buzz? <laughs> How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. This poor woman here. <laughs> she gotta fix everything. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Uh-huh. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Thanks. Yep. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm. <laughs> It smells funny in here. Yeah, because we're in a barn. Like shit, right? <laughs> yes, Clem, like shit. Good job. Don't judge me, Katja. Hey, don't use swear words, okay? What? <laughs> Why not? Okay. So you can say it, Lee? Why? Because you're an adult? That all makes sense. You need to stop cussing too, Lee. Here, I got something for you, bum. I had. You found it. I told you I'd find it. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? Oh, it's my probably gosh. nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. What? Do you think you'll ever have kids? You want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Hey, Andy, you won't mind if I look in the stalls, right? I mean, we possibly may be living here, and we probably use these stalls as bedrooms. Just... Oh. Looks like a bunch of old, dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Yeah, we probably need to go. I want to put in the hay. Jesus Christ. Just stay close to your mom for now. You scared me, Sid. Okay. <laughs> Do that to me! Hey, Andy, what's, uh... What's back here? You found it too, huh? Jesus Christ, Kenny! Lee, they're hiding something. What's in the family? The store. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff. Something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. You should. It's my job to be paranoid, Why? Lee. Why, because you're a dick. I got my whole family on this farm right now. Mm -hmm. How about you? What about Clem? Look, I can't save much, but all I'm gonna tell you is don't eat the food. I'll protect her no matter what. Yeah. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? Andy. He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there. Shut up, I think you can hear us. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. That's not... So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. You hear yourself? Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. Think. All right, Professor, what'd you have in mind? 
Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. It's a lock. Hey, Lee. What? You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? <laughs> oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Timmy! Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. No! Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. No, you're not. <laughs> you know, Larry may not be so bad after all. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. What? I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. What? <laughs> can I help you boys find something? No, we're good. <laughs> Everything's cool. Kenny's just being a dumb racist white guy over here. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. <laughs> Just don't roam around without me or Danny. Okay. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Where is he, by the way? Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Why not? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. Who's Andrew? No problem. Right away, Doc. <laughs> Why is she called him Andrew? Like, his full name over here. Isn't it just Andy? Alright, um, it looks like I'm... Doing all the fucking work because Florida man just refuses to do anything. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Anything else you want me to do for you, Kenny? My God, I'm doing everything. Oh, <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I managed just fine. Plus, I had my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. This place is a fucking shit show. You know what? This this is actually the perfect time to sabotage and do what I need to do because um, you got Mama up there flirting with Larry out of all people. You got Andy in the barn. I'm I'm sorry. His name is Andrew. Andrew in the barn helping out Kasha with the cow, and then you got other brother over there i forgot his name but he is caressing a gun as we speak so everyone's occupied with something i'm just gonna borrow this for a second yeah i'll bring it right back there you go. looks like that belt's driving the uh whatchamacallit um yeah that sounds about right <laughs> Ow! Damn it! Lee! It's moving fast! <laughs> I, I pressed the wrong button, I'm sorry. Ow! Damn it! Thing is moving fast! What? That screwdriver doesn't work either? How do you stop it? Oh, maybe if I turn it off, <laughs> I won't have this issue! Good lord. Just had a Carly moment there. I miss her so much. How is she doing with Ben? She gets to miss out on dinner. There. That should do it. Yeah, a whole rotator thing is is gone now. Fucking Danny, where do you find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it all. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this will take forever. You're doing great, Kenny. Just sitting there doing nothing. Oh no. Clementine, don't. Don't go to dinner. Do not go to dinner. Mom, Dad, dinner time. It's dinner time. Oh, my God. Okay, honey, let's get that. Y no. Dad, oh my Dad, God. come on. Let's eat. Dad. <laughs> Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. Stay here. I'll make an excuse for you. No. Get that thing off. No, uh, you get to go to dinner and I have to stay. <sighs> Why did y'all take Clem? Oh my god, why why do I have to go into this door for Kenny? This is Kenny's idea! If I didn't know what dinner time was actually, I would be pissed right now. I'd be like, um, excuse me, why am I not eating? I need to eat. I am the leader of this group. Why am I over here playing detective for something that is possibly not true? And I'm over here screwing the screws. Off the door handle! It's worth it though, and it really is. Because this shit is behind the door. 
Just a little friendly reminder, this is supposed to be a dairy farm, not the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Don't, don't be offended if I pass on dinner tonight. Just... What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Oh my god. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So, so you see, nothing to worry about. The blood is fresh, man. I'm just gonna take the bread. You are wow. an angel. Larry. Oh Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. I thought this place was supposed to be safe. Don't worry. That was a while ago and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. How about a person? Where's Mark? Yeah, where is he? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Where is he? Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Oh, I'll scrub it clean, thank you. Where the fuck is Mark at? Mark. Mark, it's Lee. I'm here to save you, where are you? Mark. Shit. I don't think they heard me, I think I'm good. Okay, okay, we're good. Is that you banging up there? Mark, can you hear me? It's Lee. Alright, we're good, we're good. Mark, where are you, buddy? Are you in here, Mark? No. Shit. Look at all this shit. What do they need so much morphine for? Gee, I don't know. <laughs> what do they need so much morphine for? You, I don't know, Lee. I don't know. Candles. Smart. The candles for? Musty as hell. Yeah, it's for blood. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Yeah, Mark did. Yeah, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? They don't need anything like this. I could promise you that. I'm just gonna. Mark! How do I find you? Are you in here? Oh, he's behind there. Is that blood? Yes. Yes, that is blood. That's Mark's blood. Where the hell is Mark? Thought Brenda said he was up here resting. Yeah, she did say that, didn't she? She must be lying then. Uh, because farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. The the cookbook? You don't think they're gonna put season on Mark? They will. They're gonna put seasoning on him. That's what they need the cookbook for, I'll tell you that. How do I, how do I move this? I think I need to go downstairs for a little bit. Hold on, to trigger it. What the hell? That's Mark, that's Mark. Buddy, where are you? Mark, how do I move the bookshelf? Oh, I'm dumb. I have to connect the cords down here. I missed that. Hang on, Mark. What the hell? Can you see Mark through there? No need. Um, we'll just, um, go around now. And I think we'll be able to move the bookshelf. Honestly, I don't know why I need a power cable to move a bookshelf, but okay. <laughs> That's fine. Go ahead, open up that door, Lee. Open it up. Lee. Oh, Mark, you took Mark. your leg. No, they took both legs. Oh, God. Oh, we're eating his legs. Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? God, 
get down there. Get down there right now, Lee. Lee, run. Run. Get down there before she eats the meat. Get down there before she eats Lieutenant Dan's legs. Sorry, his name is Mark, but <laughs> I can't help it. Oh my god, Clip! No, 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 don't, don't eat that Clip! Clip! Don't eat that! Huh? Huh? Oh, thank god. Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Yep. Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Mm -mm. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He dug his chowing down. They can use some goddamn manners. I have something to say. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Ridiculous. You're scaring the kids, Lee. Shut the fuck Lee, up. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? What's wrong with me? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. You can keep eating if you want. Dad, I was eating that. Oh my God. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. Yeah, that's your girl, Larry. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. People? It's <laughs> how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? <laughs> to continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Yeah, if you just let us go, we'll let you keep Mark. How about that? <laughs> just... Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the what? The fucking what? Put what? your what? guns down! We're walking out Don't of go here! Near my fucking right. family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay! But it's not! Lee! Lee! Oh, it's okay, Clip! Oh, oh no! Bro. Bro. Let go of her, you son of a Bro. bitch! Mark's here. <laughs> Mark fell down the stairs. 